So today I'm here at the Grand Hotel at the Russia Tourism Exchange with Margarita Yakovleva, the general manager of Metropole Express. So Margarita, please tell us what is the purpose of your visit here to Taiwan? Okay. Our company, which is called Metropole, is uh, having two branches. One is in Moscow and another one is on the shore of Lake Baikal. And uh, we see that uh, the number of uh, tourists from Taiwan is increasing with every year. So that is why we arrived here to show the new opportunities, to show what the tourists can see in uh, Lake ba at Lake Baikal and in Moscow also. That is why we just uh, gathered uh, some main tourist companies here in Taiwan and show them our information <laughs> about uh, some new directions and itineraries which can be uh, made in Russia in whole and uh, especially at Lake Baikal. Got it. And yes, everybody knows Moscow and how about Siberia? Do you receive many Taiwanese tourists and what are the plans for you? for your company uh -huh. for next year mm -hmm. for Taiwan. Mm -hmm. So as I mentioned, some of Taiwanese groups are coming. Uh, we have received several Taiwanese uh, companies or tourist groups already uh, last year. And uh, we see that uh, the number of such groups are increasing uh, now and uh, in winter time and in summer time also. And uh, we think that uh, the quality of services is getting uh, better and better in Siberia and at Lake Baikal especially. And uh, we are sure that we can provide a high quality services for these groups and I'm sure that they will be satisfied. We have got uh, good hotels, good buses and good uh, guides also. That is why we, are, we have come to welcome, <laughs> to welcome uh, uh, the tourists to Lake Baikal. And what do you think was now with the new visa-free regime for Taiwan? Uh -huh. There is no need for Russian mm -hmm. citizens to come to Taiwan. Yes, yes. We were very pleased to hear this news, uh, to hear this information. And uh, you know, we uh, think that uh, Taiwanese government, Taiwan, Taiwan government, is, uh, was so kind to to make free visas, uh, free free entry uh, for Russian tourists. We very hope we very hope uh, that uh, the Russian the Ministry of Foreign Affairs uh, will uh, make the uh, the same uh, for the Taiwanese tourists. But uh, I suppose that this depends not only from Ministry of Foreign Affairs but also from Chinese government. This is the main I think um, point. Uh, uh, but I hope uh, maybe in some uh, close uh, time, I hope it will, <laughs> it will be the same for Taiwanese tourists to yes, Russia. Yes, that's the first step into that direction. Yes, sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. And is there anything else you would like to share with Taiwanese tourists who want to visit Russia? Uh, you mean show... Share anything else? Oh, we can provide uh, any kind of uh, tours all over Russia. Uh, for example, this year I received a group uh, which was uh, traveling, uh, which was visiting Siberia, Kamchatka, uh, Vladivostok and um, uh, Sakhalin Island and they were very pleased with the, uh, with the service and the food and uh, big fish, big crabs and um, some picnics on the shore and they were satisfied with this tour. Got it. Amazing. Thank you so much. Dintian Bogan Yikatilina lies a Yurkutsk Bejarhuda Lusing Shis Xiao Shou Jingli. Taga woman Jia Shao Nin Dintian lied out Taiwan de Yoshima Mubiao. Go away the Pang Yoman Dadia Hao. Uh, was you all was the Ren Koshu Hoishu Potong Hua. Dintian woman Laila Taiwan, just a deeds of the woman Jia the Taiwan Dao. 非常漂亮的一个地方，不过怎么样，俄罗斯去旅游也很很很好的一个地方，所以我们来了台湾，找一些新的合作伙伴，希望多一点的台湾人过来西伯利亚旅游。那您来到尤库斯克有多台湾人
。北极二湖它是世界上最深的湖泊，淡水湖泊最大的之一。它有很多特点，呃，和别的地方不一样。它的美丽的超美丽的风景，它的水非常漂亮，非常好喝。有几个地方。最有名的叫奥利红岛，奥利红岛，各位的可以看一下蓝冰，世界上别的地方没有这样的机会。嗯，那来自啊，二零一九年，呃，对俄罗斯、印太关系啊、呃，你觉得有什么其他的计划？你们公司有什么进步？是吧？呃，我们回到伊尔库茨克之后，打算努力工作。因为今天发现很多台湾人对俄罗斯的历史、对俄罗斯漂亮的原始大自然很感兴趣，所以我们会到伊尔库茨克，会和这边的旅行社和这边的人继续联系，给他们介绍多一点的信息，给他们介绍我们的北极二湖。嗯。那有什么其他的啊、呃、消息可以介绍？希望我们俄罗斯和台湾关系越来越紧密，在台湾找到多一点的好朋友。<笑>好，谢谢。